Okay guys, so today we're going to be doing the Mad Libs Generator in Python. It's a very easy project. Um, this is mainly for beginners. If you know what you're doing, then I, you probably shouldn't watch this video. There's uh, other projects you can do. But this is mainly for people who are just getting started. It's, uh, it's a good project to do and to have fun with. Um, so basically what it is, is you define um, adjectives, places, and names, nouns. And then it's slotted into a paragraph and you can, depending on what you input, that's what goes into the paragraph. So I'll show you now what exactly I mean. Suppose we're going to go adjective one is equal to input and then say enter a adjective. And then we're going to go place one is equal to input enter a place then we're gonna go color one I'm just making it one in case you know you want to add more to so doing a confused input into a color and then let's go name one is equal to input oh gosh I can't type into a name and then let's go day on cool okay now comes the paragraph so we're just gonna make it yeah print and then let's go last night i was boom adjective there comma uh i came home from a um, the walls at the place again. So we're going to call that place twice. Were boom. Uh, the guy I met. had an odd name it was and then boom and then full stop this all happened on now we're going to go dot format we're going to go adjective comma place one we're going to do place one twice because I'm referring to it twice in the paragraph uh, then color, or space, then name, and then day. Cool. So let's test it out quickly. Enter an adjective, let's say, I was tired, uh, came in from a bar, uh, the walls were bright to red. The name, uh, let's say, what's a peculiar name? Let's just say Spider Man. Even though everyone knows it is, it's not normal to have the name of Spider Man. Um, and then let's say this happened on Saturday. Last night I was tired, I came over from a bar, the walls at the bar were bright red. The guy I met at the bar had an odd name, it was Spider Man. This all happened on Saturday. It's actually meant to be a full stop there because there's way too many commas in that sentence. But <laughs> yeah, um, you can also use uh, the print string like this. You can say, I'm just going to do a short version of it so you can see what I mean. Let's just do the first part last night. I was, and then you go space, comma, and then adjective. And you'll see what I mean now. It has the same, I'm not going to do it for the entire string, it's going to take too long, but let me just go tired, bar, go cyan, Spider-Man, and see, oh, I just added, this shouldn't be there, but yeah, 
if you take away that space on left there, it would be the same thing, and you can do it like this, and then continue it there, then comma, and then outside of the inverted commas, you put the the variable, and it will work the same. Or you can use an f string too. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching.